A Madison County tradition returned over the weekend. Thousands of people made their way to the Winterset area for the Covered Bridge Festival and Parade. Taj Simmons was there. Tells us why this event had a little extra significance this year. These covered bridges have long been Madison County's claim to fame. While a book and a movie turn these spans into American icons, the Covered Bridge Parade is the best example of Madison County's local pride. I've been in a parade countless times. I, yeah, I've watched it all my life. Kent Collins believes the parade, like the bridges themselves, connects Madison County in a special way. The crowds are coming back. They've got to get out of the house. They want to get back to normal as much as they can. That crowd included many Madison County parents who introduced their children to the tradition. My sister and I grew up coming here when we were little, and this is the first time that we brought our boys, so yeah, yeah it was fun. Some children took in the entertainment, <laughs> while others focused on filling their sack with candy. <laughs> How much candy did you get? A lot. The joyful sugar rush of the parade is a needed contrast from the pain the county felt after a deadly EF4 tornado this spring. Being Madison County strong is just one part of the recovery. The other is finding reasons to smile again. This is something that, I mean, this year just did a little different feel, and I don't know what exactly that is, but it's there. The covered bridges and its tourists are also here. The link between a proud past and the county's optimistic future. In Winterset, I'm Tosh Simmons.